Okay guys, so this is the new case here of the Norwood family of Virginia and their teenage son, 17 year old Levi, did the unthinkable to their, his mother and his little brother and wounded his father before stealing a car and trying to get away. Let's take a look at what happened here. Another senseless tragedy. On Valentine's Day, 17-year-old Levi Norwood shot his mother, Jennifer, age 34, and his little brother, Wyatt, age 6, inside their Virginia home. When his father, Joshua Norwood, age 37, arrived home, he found his wife and his younger son dead. Joshua said that his son, Levi, fired several rounds at him, but he managed to escape and call 911 at around 6 p.m. Officers surrounded the home in Midland area for several hours, believing that Levi was inside. But when the SWAT team entered the home at about 10.15 p.m., Levi was gone. Deputies searched the house, the outbuildings, other areas on the property. They found nothing. Investigators say Levi stole a 2007 red Toyota Camry about five miles away. And the car was reported stolen at about 7.30 a.m. Saturday. Manhunt ensued. Boquier County Sheriff Robert Mosier said Sunday that after a day-long manhunt, the murder suspect Levi Norwood, 17, was arrested in Durham, North Carolina. On Saturday, on, suspicious of shop, on suspicion of shoplifting at a Target, Levi was arrested in the sporting goods section of the store trying to steal hair dye, clothes, and a backpack. Authorities recovered the stolen car, the Toyota Camry, when Levi was arrested in North Carolina. The car has not been searched to determine what Levi had inside. Scott Hook, the county commonwealth's attorney, said Sunday that Levi Norwood Norwood would likely be extradited to Virginia sometime next week. He is expected to appear in court in North Carolina before then. The Sheriff's Office has asked residents in Fauquier County to remain cautious and alert during the manhunt. They also ask that people check their security cameras and contact the Sheriff's Office if they spot anything suspicious. Police say there was no history of any other 911 calls to the Norwoods home since they have lived there before Josh Norwood's call to 911 on Friday. And they say they are looking into Levi Norwood's social media and other communications. Tried as an adult, Norwood would face two murder charges and likely more according to Boquer County Commonwealth's attorney Scott Hook, he may be tried as an adult. That's something we're going to have to decide once we have him back in Virginia, said Hook. Anyone with further information on this case is asked to contact the Falkier County Sheriff's Office at 540-347-3300. And we have yet another senseless act that destroys a family. Rest in peace to this mother, Jennifer, and this little boy, Wyatt. And we pray for these things to stop it's just it's getting to be so so many right uh, it's so tragic we question whether it's just social media bringing it to our awareness or if there are indeed more tragedies like this such a terrible thing rest in peace